Hey guys, what's going on? It's Grant from Grant and Shelby, and uh, in the kitchen, just because I don't have a seat anymore. But um, as I'm leaving the apartment, my barbell box just came in, and um, I want to do a real quick um, unboxing, because one, I don't know what supplements I'm going to keep for the move and things like that, but I can tell you guys right now, it is super, super heavy. Again, this is the Barbell Box for November. For those of you guys who don't know, Barbell Box is a fitness subscription box, costs around $35. Um, and I really like this box because it pr provides just a ton of supplements. Um, typically like pre-workouts, fat burners, protein, BCAAs, all of the, 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 whole, the whole mix. So they have provided some equipment in the past and some like bags and some shirts and things like that, but mainly they focus on supplements, which I really like since I get to have supplements for test reviews and things like that. So I've been a huge fan of these guys for quite some time. They are a Canadian company and they do great things. So anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and open this box and kind of get my initial reactions on it, see what's in here and see whether it's worth it or not. Let's get to it. Let's go ahead and start off with the biggest thing in here. Yeah, protein bar mix. That's pretty cool. Um, I've actually made some protein bars in the past and I really like them. Um, never tried this stuff before, but um, it's cool that a company actually does this to make like protein bars and things like that. So let's see here. Kid friendly too, which is really cool. 12 grams of protein, they're saying um, per container of 16 servings. So um, I believe like yeah, 12, 12 grams of protein per bar, which is not bad at all. Um, that's really cool, but uh, very neat there. The only thing I don't like is that you can see that right Here's where the bar mix is. Here's all the packaging. It's a lot of wasted packaging, but anyway. The next up, we've got NoCo BCAA, No Carbs Company. Um, this stuff is by like, I think it's Cassandra Martin is one of the pro staff for this, but um, they're an energy drink. Um, I actually did a review on this a while back, I believe almost a year, two years ago. Um, pretty good stuff, pretty good stuff. Um, I did the tropical, I wanna try the Caribbean to see if that's good or not, but I love energy drinks, so this is a good one. Um, it tastes okay, um, the caffeine's pretty good. It's 180 milligrams, you know, it's pretty decent here. Zero sugar, um, it's got some B12, B6, really standard type of stuff, so um, kudos there. Next up, we've got Strike Force, Strike Force Energy. Um, I've had these guys before too on the channel. I've done a full review of it. And uh, looks like it's kind of the same thing except, nope, yep, they're liquid form. And then also you can get 20% off all your orders by using the barbell box for checkout. Next we got more Cookie Smart Fuel. Um, it's just a cookie with, uh, let's see here, blueberry chia, bluet chia, I don't know. I guess that's blueberry. Seven grams of fiber, no peanuts, and yeah, just a healthy cookie. Oh, and it looks like we also got another one too. Um, there's, this one is cranberry quinoa. Ugh, that doesn't sound too good. And then we've got pump from um, Promera Sports. I'm not sure um, if that video has released yet, but I did a review of their pre-workout. You guys can figure out my, or see my results on that video. It's either coming up or it's already on the channel. Um, it's gonna be linked with this one, but this is the pump. So it is their NO or nitric oxide formula to um, get you going to the gym just without any sort of caffeine, I'm, I'm assuming. Also, it does have caffeine in it. So that's the interesting take. Um, and then they've got a shirt. Let's see, what does the shirt say this time? Uh, it says no excuses on it. So, oh, oh, it's still a Gildan shirt, which again is, you know, as we know, it's not really that fitted, but this is a different feel. It's the soft style, so I'm really eager to try this out um, and see if it fits. All right, and sure enough, it does. Wow, it feels really good. I like this a lot. I like the gray a lot. Um, I really like this. This one's actually pretty neat. The uh, graphic on this as well. So, I mean, this fits pretty well. I just did shoulders recently earlier today. So like figured it would be, you know, feeling a little bit hard here, but it's not, it feels great. It feels awesome. 
overall overall reaction of this box, I like it. I like it a lot. Um, the only thing I might not be using is this, just because of it's kind of hard. But I might I might take this with me to see if uh, we can actually make these or not, and kind of do some sort of real quick video, see if we can make them. But everything else, I feel like I can totally bring with me, which is awesome. Um, like the shirt a lot, like NoCo. Um, the pump stuff is definitely something I would definitely try. And then also probably try this one, the Chia one with blueberry. Definitely not clean one. That sounds really, really gross. So you guys know the drill. Gonna be going over their prices, seeing if it's worth it or not, um, and seeing if it's worth $35. One thing to note is that they are a Canadian company, as I stated earlier. So the average typically is 75 cents per Canadian dollar. Right, so with that being said, let's jump on into it. We're gonna go with the cookies first, right? The cookies, um, the two cookies, the one blueberry, chia, and then the, uh, cranberry quinoa, uh, quoted to be $10 Canadian, so $7.50 US. A little steep there, my personal opinion, um, but these are definitely smart cookies or, you know, healthier cookies, I guess you could say. Um, I personally wouldn't like to spend 350 for these. If, if I were to do anything, I'd probably put them to two, so $4 there. Again, not bad, but also not great. All right, then we got the Strike Force. Uh, the Strike Force packet, I believe there's about four of them in there. Yeah, there's four different variety ones. Um, you've got original grape, orange, and lemon. Quoted this to be $8 Canadian, so $6 US. Really like the original. Grape is a little bit too much. Lemon is insane amount, but orange is actually pretty good too. So um, yeah, it's okay. It's all right. Um, Six dollars is a little bit steep, but like it's ready to drink type of caffeine. So it's really like a five hour energy type of thing and you're getting four of them. And if you think about a five hour energy, it's like what, 250-ish per? So I mean, I put it at five just to make it easy, right? So. We're already looking at $9. So we've got the bar mix. This is going to be a $25 Canadian, so $18.75 US. Not bad. I don't know exactly how much you're gonna be charging for that amount. Um, I would say, so we're actually on sale right now, so what, $20 Canadian, so closer to $15 US. I put them closer to like $20 Canadian, $15 US, um, just because of the fact that like, that's what they state them on their site right now. Um, think that that's a really good deal anyway. Um, that's a that's honestly a steal right there. NoCo, two of them, $8 Canadian, $6 US. Little steep there. Um, you can get those at a gas station for probably two bucks. Put about four. And we've got the pump, $10 Canadian, so $7.50 US. So a dollar eighty-seven, a dollar eighty-eight, depending on how you round it. Uh, again, really expensive there. Typically, a dollar per like serving is typically good, um, but they are single packets, right? So they're a little bit different there. But um, I probably put it at a dollar fifty each. So we're looking at what six? Then we've got the shirt. Shirt is thirty dollars Canadian, um, and then it's twenty-two fifty U.S. 22 is a little bit high, I think, in my personal opinion. Um, probably, again, put it closer to like 18. It's a really, it's a better shirt compared to the other ones, so I will give them credit for that. Um, I really like the design as well. Um, so 18 to $20, I feel a lot more comfortable than 22.50. So all in all, with this box, you're looking at a $52 value for $35. Think that that's definitely worth it. I mean, like you're almost getting even double the amount of the value, which is awesome to see. You know, a lot of these boxes, especially during this time frame, especially during what's happening right now, it's really hard to find some of these supplements. So, um, I give them full props with all of this. I really, really do like the shirt. This is something that they should definitely be keeping, focusing more on the softness of the shirt. Because, man, I'm definitely going to be wearing this. The only thing I don't like is the tag, but I think I can tear that off anyway. Come on, there you go. Yeah, taking the tag off is so much better. I mean like, this is something that you're not gonna be getting in like your standard like subscription box, just straight up. That's something that's definitely different. On top of that, they definitely bring in a lot of other companies with like Promera, and I do like their products. I've, I've liked every single product that I've had with those guys since. So 
Um, very a big fan. Strike Force and No Co. Straight up, just caffeine to the dome. Like that a lot. Um, the cookies are just the only thing I'm like, a eh, little bit skeptical about. Don't really need. Don't really want. So. Um, if I had to rate this box, man, I would give it like a B plus almost to an A minus. It is that good, um, in my personal opinion. Um, I think that they provided well-roundedness whenever it came to um, the supplements. Uh, you definitely get the shirt, you know, like pretty much their routine type of stuff. But then on top of that, they provided something completely different, completely left field. They have done a lot of like baking, I've noticed too, with like, um, with the pancakes, with providing even the gingerbread stuff a couple of months back. So they're definitely like applying a lot more food in there, which I absolutely enjoy um, for snacking, for however it may be. And then on top of that too, they provide like really like old school type of stuff that they've had, that they've partnered in the past with. And honestly, pretty big fan of. B plus to an A minus 89%. Um, probably like 89.5, so depending on where you round up or round down. Um, I love this. This is a good one. Kudos, barbell, kudos. So anyway, I wanna know your guys' thoughts on this box. Um, what did you guys think about it? Did you like it, did you hate it? Did you feel like there was something missing? Please let me know in the comments down below. And if you haven't, please like it, subscribe, and thank you so much for watching.